talking with a friend of mine yesterday and we were just talking nothing nothing special sitting down I was at his house we were watching some sports some sports highlights football game on, um, on TV so we were just talking and just random conversation and I asked him if he was if he was familiar with or if he's ever, if, if he's ever heard of the of the term noise pollution, and I'm not surprised. He said no. He didn't. He he's never heard of it, but he had an idea of what it was connected to. I mean, yeah, because it's easy to to know because because of the word because noise is part of it and pollution is part of it. So you can easily tie those two things together. But he didn't, I, I, w I was not surprised that he didn't really know what it meant and that he's never thought about it. What it means to, or um, not really what it means, but um, that it has an effect on, you know, on, on how it made him feel. So that was actually the question I, that I asked him next. After I explained to him that noise pollution was just un unwanted, sounds that we hear, un unwanted noises and sounds that irritate us that we can't control. And I gave him some examples of noise pollution, like traffic and uh, lawnmowers that are outside, and just loud things that airplanes flying by, uh, uh, airplane jets flying by. So asked him if he was just really understanding that, or if, if he even believed that they that they made him feel a certain way. And he really didn't know. He never thought about it. And that was an honest response. And that's actually the response that I had myself before I even found out what it was or what it was about. So I just tried a little experiment on him. And I just, um, I borrowed some paper that he had, some just notebook paper, nothing. And I just crumbled it up. Uh, really fast and I put it and I placed it next to his ear as I was crumbling it up and asked him if it bothered, bothered him if it, you know if it if it was irritating and he said no you know I didn't think so so I did it again and this time I crumbled the paper really slow yeah probably I stretched it out for about 20 seconds and he just sort of uh, yanked his ear away like so I said you know why'd you move he said man it, I can't just listen to that all the time so that that further started our deeper conversation about noise pollution these sounds that irritate us because if you imagine just the sound of something like that paper crumbling that paper but but just sub substituted with something else some other noise that we're surrounded by and hearing that all day long and every day our brain, number one, is trying to process it. And number two, our ears don't like it. So when you place those two things together, how do you think that's going to make you feel?